Hi, I hope you're all well. Today I wanted to stop by to talk about uh, something, a strategy that I, I use and I used to use more when I had very high anxiety and panic attacks and especially when my anxiety was really high or my, my panic was so high that um, nothing could bring it down or there was almost nothing that I could do to feel more regulated or to feel a little better. So I used to grab a pillow like this one, it can be big or small, um, and, and just uh, focus on um, putting the image here of my inner child or that part of me that was very scared um, and terrified. And so I just started to hold it and hug it and even um, caress it like I would with a, with a small child who's scared. And then sometimes I would talk to it and just say something like, I'm here, it's okay, you're okay, uh, I'm not going anywhere. Um, this will pass soon and things like that and even just uh, just a movement too uh, would help me to really focus on uh, being with that part of myself that inner child that needed some some assistance and care and love and someone just to tell it that it's going to be okay so sometimes I would just do it for, for a small period of time until I was calm and sometimes I would fall asleep uh, holding it. Sometimes I would cry in my bed because I was feeling terrible and, and I just fell asleep holding the pillow. That was the only way that um, that I could uh, fall asleep or feel a little, more, a little bit more relieved and inhaled. So this is something that I love to use. As I said, it's just a physical reminder, uh, just to put a face on it or, or a, something to grab. You can even uh, look and, and, and put the image of your child here if you have if you have a child and imagine that is this is your child that you're holding and what you would say and what you would do if that child was feeling was feeling really scared and and alone. So I'm gonna leave that. Uh, and see if you want to use it, see if it helps you, and we'll see you in the next video.